Two weeks ago, I had a bicycle accident. I was lucky not to be hit by a car and also not to break any rib. <laughs> Nevertheless, I struck the ground hard and I've been suffering rib cage pain 24 seven and being forced to swallow many painkillers three times per day. Another side effect of that accident is being short of breathing, even walking normally on a flat surface. As in two weeks time, I'm trying to climb solo Stockholm 3,532 meters and slipping under the stars, water depending. Today, I'm testing my aerobical capacities, summiting some very accessible peaks above my place. Let's see how it goes. Dan du Jamon, 1,875 meters, having the shape of a giant canine. Really nice place to chill out. And I made it, I would say, maybe 75% of my aerobic capacity, so I'm quite happy with it. I think it's going to be ready for the Stockholm in two weeks' time. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Well, 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 I am quite surprised because I am uh, in a reasonable good shape. I should be maybe at 75, 80, 85 percent of my aerobical condition which is good and I'm quite ready for a Stockholm in two weeks time <laughs> After my swelling today, I think if I go with them, they will accept me. Hitting Cap du Monde Summit and I am extremely happy, believe it or not, because one week ago, when I was walking normally, like on a flat surface for 100 meters, I was really short to breathe, I couldn't breathe. And then the pain I had on my ribs cage was unbearable. And at night, I woke up like a four in the morning every morning. Why? Because of the pain. Bonjour, bonjour madame. I was saying to myself, I don't think we're gonna make it to Stockholm. It's gonna be too hard. So I had to test today and I'm extremely happy about the results. I can guarantee you we'll be together to Stockholm in two weeks time. Yes, together. You will come with me. You will come with me. <laughs> Cap de Moine Summit on the cross. <laughs> we made it. Thanks to this jump couple right there, they helped me to climb up because I found a climbing path, rocky, really steep. I didn't feel it. Being by myself, I said, mm -mm, I'm not gonna take the risk. And then when I was about quitting and going home, I met them and I said, do you mind if I climb up with you? Say, oh, of course, let's go together. And we made it. <laughs> Time to chill out. 